Hello, today we're going to be solving the 3x3 three three Rubik's Cube. It's kind of hard for some people, but I'm going to teach y'all how to solve it, and then you can go and impress your friends by solving the cube. Okay, first, if you want to cheat and not, like, know how to solve the cube, you turn the top until it's, like, not compared with the other cubes. You slip your finger under that, take each piece out. And then you keep doing that until the compl the whole cube is taken apart, and then you can put all the pieces back in the normal position pattern. Okay, but cheating is not really the good way to do it because then you can't impress your friends because taking it apart takes a while and putting it back together. So what's really impressive is you can solve it right in front of their eyes just by after they mess it up. But first, I'm going to have to show you the move notation before we get started. So let's get started with the move notation. This side right here that's sh that's right in front of you, that's the front side. That's the front side. This would be front. Up here is the top. That'd be top. Right here is the right side, which would be right. This is the left side. This would be left, because it's clockwise. And this is the downside. When I would say, if I would say up inverted, that means you would do counterclockwise. See how it's counterclockwise? up is regular clockwise see but up inverted is counterclockwise so if I were to say right inverted you would do this and if I were to say right you would do this so that's good okay first let's scramble our cube and then we can get ready to solve it let's do it Okay, you can see how it's nice and scrambled. Okay, what we're first going to do on solving the Rubik's Cube is we're going to solve the cross on the cube, but you first have to choose the side you're going to start it on. So, I usually start with the green side because that's the way I learned how to solve it. So, what we're first going to need to do is solve the first green cross right here. So, let's find the green corner pieces. So, you like this one? You gotta put that one right here. So, so you would line this up. See, and now you have that piece right there. Okay, you gotta find another one right there. You just turn that up, and now you have that. Let's find another one right there. You would turn this, slide it up, and now you have that. Now you only need one more piece. The pieces right there. So we turn that and turn it up. Now we have the cross. Let me get that piece out. Okay, now we have the cross. Okay, but now you, that you've done that, now you have to make sure that it lined up with this. So let's turn that. See how that orange lined up with that orange? And that white lined up with that white? See that yellow and red don't line up? And that red and yellow don't line up? You gotta switch these pieces. So you gotta go down. Switch out. And now you have the cross, and all of them line up. Okay, next is to solve the corner pieces. All the greens corner pieces, see? So that piece, there's a green corner piece, and there's one right there. Okay. This is going to be your first algorithm, algorithm that you're going to have to learn. I hate that word, okay. So, see how that green piece is right there? You need to get it right there. Always make sure that it is in... A corner underneath it so it's right there so do this right inverted down inverted right down see and it put the piece where it needs to be and it's lined up see white orange it's lined up you just use that all the time when you need to get a piece see like this one see how it's right there you can still use it like that so use right right inverted down inverted right down, right inverted, down inverted, right down. Okay, you see how that got piece right there? And it's lined up with that piece. See, red, yellow, red, yellow. See, it's lined up. We have another one right here. See, it's right there. Do this. Right inverted, down inverted, right down. 
that piece is right there and it's lined up. See? Now we have one more to go. It's right there. You were to get this piece right here. See how it's like underneath it? Do right inverted, down inverted, right, down, 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 right inverted, down inverted, right, down. You have the whole green side solved, and it's all lined up the first row. And it's also lined up the center, so you have to make sure you get the center with it, too. And also, if the green piece is directly underneath the where it needs to go, you can still use that algorithm to do that. You do right inverted, down inverted, right, down, right inverted, down inverted, right, down, right inverted, down inverted, right, down. And it lined it up. Okay, so so there's no confusion. I had to show you that. Okay, next we're going to have to do is solve the second second layer. So make sure the green is on the bottom. So blue's on top. So make sure the green, the solved side is on the bottom. And then we'll go on from there. Okay, next we're going to have to solve the second layer. Okay, find a piece that is that would go up with one of the sides. See one of these sides that are not solved? See how it's white and red? We gotta find a white and red spot. So it's right there. See? White, red, white, red. Gotta put red and white right there. You're gonna have to flip that piece and put it right there. So then it'll be in the correct spot. To do this, use this algorithm. You use up inverted, left inverted, up, left, up, front, up inverted, front inverted. And then you got that piece right there and it's all solved right there. Okay, so let's do it again. See how that that's orange and white? That's orange and white. You're going to have to flip that piece to go right there. So let's do it. Let's do up inverted, left inverted, up, left, up, front, up inverted, front inverted. See, you didn't mess the green side up, and it's right there, and you have two two of them solved, and you need two more left. Okay, next you're going to have to do it again. This piece needs to go right there. See, yellow, red, yellow, red. Let's do it again. Let's go up inverted, left inverted, up, left, up, front, up inverted, front inverted. Didn't mess the green side up. That piece is right there. You have three of them solved. That's one more you get to get. Okay. Gonna have to do it again. That piece needs to go right there. Okay, let's do it. Let's do up inverted, left inverted, up, left, up, front, up inverted, front inverted. See, the green side solved. All the the second rows are solved. So the next thing you're gonna need to do is solve the top and this last row. Sometimes you'll go where you're gonna need to go to the le to the right side. See how you're gonna have to get. The red, yellow, it's going to have to go red, yellow. You have to flip it this way. There's, you have to do the exact opposite alg algorithm for the left side, for the right side. Okay, so for this one, you would use up, right, up inverted, right inverted, up inverted, front, up, front. Okay, see, you didn't mess that up. You put that piece right there, and then you're ready to solve the top. Okay, so I'll show you one more time, and just in case you didn't see it correctly, you gotta get that white and orange piece right here. See, it's white and orange. You gotta flip that right there. So you would need to use up, right, up inverted, right inverted, up inverted, front inverted, up, front. You solved all the second rows, and then now it's time to solve the top. Okay, the next thing you need to do is solve the top blue cross. Okay, there's a lot of things you can start out with. You can start out with the top L. You could start with a cross right here, just a plain crossbar. And sometimes you can start out with just the cross already solved. And sometimes you can just start out with the dot. And then that's all the ones you can start out with. 